all righty guys welcome back Ooh, uh, welcome back we back in the demon slayer and looks like we about to hop in this special mission so let's go ahead and see what that's about you know what i mean you know what i mean you know what i'm saying reports tell of a demon appearing deep in the forest the demon resembles a man but bears blades hmm like protrusions on both elbows that it wields as weapons. Rush to the scene and destroy it. Sir, yes, sir. Um, I play with Tanjiro and Nezuko. I want to see what uh, Sukunji Uduakin. And I put Tanjiro in the support. Oh, we get the play as well. Oh, oh, it's like a legit fight, huh? Oh, he, psh, boy, is getting right into it. Chill out. This man is not playing no game. Straight body in this boy. It's a waste of my time. Oh, what you got for me, man? Come on, now. look at me. Look at me. I got my back to this boy. He ain't got nothing on me. Look, look. What he gonna do? What is he gonna do? I ain't damn. Ooh. I ain't I ain't got shit to worry about. Water breathing. He too slow for me, man. Get in there, Tundra. Uh, that's what we do, man. Damn, I almost had all of them. That's all you got, Broski? Come on now. Oh, that was clean right there. You slow. <laughs> oh, damn. What? Don't, hey, hey, what now? Hey, now, hey, hey. I got my wind breathing in and shit. I ain't know where I can go. I did that special technique for nothing. Got him. Red dot him. Water breathing can be used no matter the situation. Easy work. Opponent. B. Yeah, he was kind of working me. That was it. Can't end it like that. Come on now. Ain't nothing special, Miss Hunt. It's all videos. I guess we could watch a couple videos. Get this time going. I was on my way home from selling charcoal. This is blocked. Shoot. But before I could get very far, Mr. Saburo called out to me. Oh, feet chilling, cooling. Hang on, Tanjiro. You're not going back up the mountain now, are you? It's too dangerous. Is that a dad? Before the demons show up. Oh, they already know about the demons, huh? There's always been man-eating demons prowling about after dark. That's oh, yeah, why they only do come it's out at dark, to huh? go outside at night. Hmm, okay. These demons, they're not able to come inside people's houses, are they? Are they? Yes. They could come in. But what? But then wouldn't they just eat everyone? That's why the demon slayers protect us by killing as many as they can. They always have. Oh. I'm gonna say I can just walk in anywhere, pretty much. I stayed the night at Mr. Saburo's place. But to this day, I can't help but think. He, he what? Oh, that's that the night he didn't go home, huh? Mr. Saburo hadn't stopped me that night. He would have been there. What would have happened to me? When the demons hit your house. 
Dang, that's crazy. Demon Slayer. The Hamakami Chronicles. Hamakami. Next one. Let me just watch a couple. After spending the night at Saburo's, Tanjiro heads home, only to face a cruel reality. As I reached home, I noticed a sinister scent. Mm, okay. It was strong. Terrible. The smell of blood. Oof. Okay. Dang. Nezuko, Rokta! Nezuko. What happened? I guess this is mom. The one day he didn't come home. Whole family gone. That's crazy, man. Mom. Hanako. Takeo. Even the little, the little Shiguro. ones. That's his snow boots. Nezuko's the only one who's still warm. If I can get her to a doctor, she might live. Oh. No matter what it takes. That's how you know she was still alive, because she was born. Will save you. Did not know that. I mean, they are in the middle of the snow, though, so. You know how that go, though. I love his dad. Except for Nezuko. The sole survivor. The only survivor. But Nezuko. She wasn't the Nezuko I knew anymore. Yeah, she was grown up. She had become a demon. That too. <laughs> the Demon Slayer. The Harmakami Chronicles. Uh, let's watch a few more. Chapter 6. Dang. That's just memory fragments. Wait, how many chapters is it? They actually attacked him when he was at the crib. Nezuko was a demon. Before I could come to grips with what had happened, a swordsman appeared in front of me. Yeah, old boy came, huh? He was there to slay Nezuko. So, I did the only thing I could. And what was that? Hmm? Show me! I'm begging you. Whatever you do, please don't kill my little sister. Never give someone else the right to decide who lives and dies. Oh. All you're doing is making yourself vulnerable. If it were even a little bit effective, your family would still be alive right now. Oh, that's crazy. How can a weakling like you have any hope of finding a way to heal his sister, let alone hunt down a demon? Did he really say that? Don't make me laugh! The weak have no rights. They don't get to make choices. All they can do is be relentlessly crushed by the straw! Kind of sad. I needed to protect Nezuko. Even if it meant fighting off this swordsman. There was no way an amateur like me could win against him. But luckily... Boy, it didn't come to that. As you can tell, I am he focused in this. To give me advice, he pointed me down the right path and told me where I should turn next. Nice. Demon Slayer. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. I got. I watch. Let's see this one. When Orokudaki's training started, I climbed up and down the mountain, swinging my sword countless times. Oh, you was work working for this, huh? I had to find a way to help Nezuko, and did whatever I needed to do to become a Demon Slayer swordsman. Mm -hmm. I trained every day, and then one year one year later. later the boulder. That's it. I've taught you all I can. The rest 
is up to you. The last challenge. You must prove to me that you are capable of advancing to the next level. If you can cut this boulder in two, I'll allow you to enter final selection. Well, you gotta be pretty strong for that. After that day, that was it. He never taught me anything again. For real? Like forever? From then on, I spent every day practicing what I learned from Earl Kodaki. <laughs> but even after six more months, I couldn't cut through the. Ugh. Am I not good enough? Dang. I'm about to give up. It's impossible. Silence. It's unseen. And here he goes, Sabato. Knock it off. A demon slayer bears his suffering in silence. Isn't that what you want to be? Well, you better start acting like it. Mm -hmm. You tell him, Sabato. Sabato. There was no way I could cut the boulder. I was starting to get impatient and frustrated when suddenly this boy appeared before me. His name was Sabito. He had a mysterious aura about him. Because he was dead, huh? We found that uh, first first uh, gameplay, guys, so it's not a spoiler. Was it first gameplay? Of this series? I think so. What time is it? Uh, we can watch one more. This is the last one. As I tried to overcome my frustration from not being able to cut through the rock, mm -hmm. a boy with a mask appeared. His Sabato. name was Sabito. And there was a girl standing beside him, Makoma. Makoma? I don't really remember Sabito Makoma. acted as my sparring partner, while Makoma watched my movements and gave me advice on how to improve my form. Oh, that's nice of him. Some days, it was hard to tell if I was improving at all. But bit by mm. bit, I could feel myself growing stronger. Okay, then. You got a, you got a Rocky montage about oh, to go on? A trainer? Flesh. More. More. Yeah, this is Rocky montage right here. But... You never forget anything Oro Kodaki taught you. Pound it into the marrow of your bones. Turn that boy to the limits. With total concentration breathing, your blood circulation accelerates. Oh. Because your heart rate is faster than normal. None of that makes sense. How am I supposed to learn how to do that? That's what he be doing. Train until it kills you. <laughs> because really, when that you hurt. get down to it, there's nothing else you can do. Day after day, I fought with Sabito in front of the giant rock. While Makomo continued to give me advice. Mm -hmm. So I trained. Till my arms and legs wanted to fall off. And I trained and I trained. My and heart felt like they were going to burst. And I trained and I trained I some more. My sword. But still, Sabito kept beating me. Until six months later. Demon Slayer, the Hami Kami. Alright, guys, we're gonna wrap it up right there. So, we'll be back in the chapter 3 next time. Yeah, chapter 3. So, see y'all next time.